afternoon, my Connor kiddos. Such a windy, crazy day today. I'm sure you're inside doing lots of homework. <laughs> Kate, say hi. She's coming to say hello. No, she's stretching. Stinker. Okay, today I'm reading. You know this one, don't you? Because it's called The Pigeon Needs a Bath. Do I need a bath? Is that what you're trying to tell me? Okay, it's Pictures and Words by Mo Williams. And remember when we had our Lego contest to see um, who could build the best pigeon? Make it look just like this? That was so fun. So we'll probably do something like that again in the fall with a different character. So here we go. The pigeon needs a bath. I do not. It looks kind of dirty. Huh? <clears throat> Hi, I don't know if you've noticed, but the pigeon is filthy. So I could use your help because the pigeon needs a bath. That is a matter of opinion, says the pigeon. What a kidder. I don't really need a bath. one last month and I think it was last month scratch scratch clean dirty they're just words right I feel clean maybe you need a bath <laughs> yeah when was the last time you had a bath oh that was pretty recently <laughs> Life is so short. Why waste it on an unimportant things like taking a bath? What smell? <laughs> I don't smell anything. And if I do, it's a very normal smell for a pigeon. You know, in some places, it's impolite to bathe. <laughs> All of these flies buzzing around me are purely coincidental. Pretty sure that flies only go around stinky things. And the bees even say, P.U. Yuck! Let's get out of here. Take a bath, dude. Okay, fine. If it means so much to you, I will take a bath. Whoa. I'm not going to like this one bit. Okay, we get all the little pictures. The water is too hot. Now it's too cold. It's too lukewarm. It's too hot. Oh, it's too wet. It's too cold. There's not enough toys. Oh, there's too many toys. <laughs> it's too deep. Oh, it's not deep enough. But he even lets them out and puts more in. And then he says again, it's too cold. Now it's too hot again. It's too reflective. Well, I guess this is okay. This is still too hot. Wash, 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 wash. La, 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 singing in the tub. This is the life. Ooh, I love bubbles. Look at my wrinkly toes. Hello? Hello. How are you? I'm fine. I'm a fish. I'm a fish. Then, hours later. Can I stay in the tub forever? And that's the end. That's 
Some of you guys are like that when you when you were really little and you say, I don't want to take a bath. And then you get in and you play for hours and hours. And my kids would be like, please, I don't want to get out. It's so much more fun in here. We had too many bath toys, I think. So, Kate, let's see what she Kate. She's just exhausted. She's had a really long day. She went out and played really hard in the wind. And I think it just tuckered her right out. She's probably asleep for like a good four hours right there. <laughs> okay, I have a challenge for you today. Here's your card so you can kind of see what it looks like. Does that look like the Statue of Liberty? Because it is. Is the Statue of Liberty A, a gift from France celebrating the 100th birthday of the United States? Is it B, a statue shipped across the ocean in 350 pieces. Is it C, a statue with sandals 25 feet long? Or is it D, all of the above? Okay, if you think you know the answer, reply, and I will check my email, my YouTube comments, my fa two different Facebook accounts. I will find the first person to respond, bring a treat to your doorstep, okay? So good luck, have a lovely day, and I will talk to you tomorrow. Bye-bye.